Hello, my name is Michael Wells and I'm an engineering technologist with Dell. Today, we're gonna to talk about the Apex Cloud Platform for Red Hat OpenShift, the newest addition to the Apex Cloud Platform family designed for running OpenShift on-premises. OpenShift is an industry-leading Kubernetes platform, but it's not just about containers. It can also run virtual machines as well as serverless. But the platform that we're running on, the underlying infrastructure, utilizes our MC nodes, which are based on our industry-leading PowerEdge servers. So we start with our compute cluster with four or more nodes. On top of that, we've got Red Hat CoreOS. Then we layer on our storage data client and our container storage interface. Then we have OpenShift 4.13 and the ACP Foundation software. We'll talk more about that in a moment. On top of that, we have the OpenShift Web Console, the Web Console is used for managing the cluster itself, and then on top of that, we have Advanced Cluster Management. Advanced Cluster Management, of course, is um, Red Hat solution for managing multiple OpenShift clusters. What makes this solution unique is this ACP Foundation. Right, The ACP Foundation software allows us to project the infrastructure management directly into the OpenShift web console. That means your OpenShift administrators are using the same tooling to manage the infrastructure as they're using to manage the cluster and the applications that sit on top of the cluster. Right, So the same tool they're using day in and day out. They're not having to jump out of that to move into some other third-party tool to manage the infrastructure. It also allows us to do a consistent update process, right? That means when you go through the web console and you update the cluster, you're not just updating the OpenShift software, but you're updating all of the Dell components and the infrastructure underneath as well, using continuously validated state. That means that we're regularly testing the software from OpenShift along with our foundation software and the BIOS firmware and drivers in the infrastructure to ensure that all of that runs together seamlessly, right? So you get one update process that you can feel confident is going to work across the entire solution stack. This is great for running applications, virtual machines, um, but eventually you're gonna need to store data. This is where the storage cluster comes in. We use a disaggregated design, means that the storage nodes are separate from the compute nodes, but it allows us to scale compute and storage independently, right? So you don't have to worry about, do I need to add more nodes to compute? Is that gonna oversize my storage or do I need to add more storage, but I don't need more compute, right? Scaling each one independently makes that seamless, it gives you more flexibility. On this, we have our Dell software-defined storage, right? This provides highly performant and highly scalable block services. On top of that, we're running the Red Hat Enterprise Linux operating system. And then our storage management tools. This storage is consumed directly from the OpenShift cluster, utilizing the CSI and software data client. That gives you the ability to provision persistent volume claims right from within OpenShift 
it talks directly to the storage through that CSI layer and will actually provision the volumes on the storage layer for you, right? So you can provision volumes, you can delete volumes, you can snapshot those volumes all from within OpenShift using YAML. We also have the ability to layer on additional uh, components from Dell, our uh, Dell container storage modules. So you can leverage modules like uh, observability, resiliency, authorization, to be able to add more features to expose those up through Kubernetes, through OpenShift in a Kubernetes native way, but to give you more control uh, and more capabilities from that storage tier, right? And of course, this entire solution is supported from top to bottom by Dell, right? So you have a single call support to troubleshoot or remediate any issues within the entire stack. And that is the Apex Cloud Platform for Red Hat OpenShift.